In today's research environment, data abounds, and with it, our task to manage data responsibly and efficiently. So we should consider challenges uh, of data storage, location, transportation, and how data can be linked, tracked, and uh, reproduced. So DataLad is a free and open source command line tool with a Python API that allows us to address these challenges in a distributed and collaborative way. At its core, uh, we have the DataLad dataset, which consists of a Git repository for version controlling your file tree and a data annex managed by Git annex for handling arbitrarily large file content. With this combination, DataLad lets you unlock the collaborative and distributed benefits of Git for your data. The file content of a data lab dataset can be pushed to wherever the data annex is hosted, for example, locally or in the cloud, while a complete lightweight representation of the dataset can be accessed elsewhere, such as on GitHub. Collaborators can clone this lightweight repository and gain access to specific files in the tree, with data lab taking care of the linkage, the transportation, and uh, access under the hood. DataLad assists the development of reproducible workflows by capturing the exact state of nested subdatasets, whether it's code or data. For example, a containerized analysis workflow can be versioned and then saved as an input together with input data to a new DataLad dataset. And this dataset can then capture the provenance record when running the analysis, which means it captures the exact version of the code that was run on which version of the input data to generate which version of the output data and when and by whom. With dedicated rerun functionality, any provenance record and dependent data can also be used to reproduce a previously, previously generated output bit by bit. DataLad is made stronger by uh, its integrations and extensions with common data infrastructure and our rich user resources. And I invite you to all have a look at them and reach out to me if you have questions. Thank you.